If you weren't expecting China to come out with something amazing shortly after the release of uh, Nano Banana Pro, then you're not paying attention to how this works anymore. So Flux has come out with their latest model uh, and it's completely open source and open weights. And honestly, it's great. Uh, there are many, many image generators out there. Most of them are pretty terrible at text, but this one has figured it out. Mike, have you tried it out? I have, and I've got a thing called replicate.com, which sort of has all of the image models in it, even Nano Banana 2. And I'd say that Nano Banana just pips it, and it's got some really um, uh, use cases that uh, Flux doesn't have. But as a raw image model, I'll tell you what, if you were in Mid Journey or any of those other models, uh, the open source, open weight people have got it nailed. And Image composition's great, angles, camera angles. Uh, so, uh, yeah, you're right. It's the uh, Nano Banana killer if you're looking at price. And if cost is no option, I'd still go Nano Banana. But Flux is pretty damn good. So one thing people don't often pay attention to is with open source, open weight models, you can run them locally, which means if you have an obscene number of images to generate, you, you've got a use case where you just need to pump out image after image after image, all of a sudden, you can do that basically for free. Uh, we're living in a, in a crazy cheap world. It, the price of AI just keeps dropping. It's gonna, we're going to see amazing things soon, I think. Yeah, and if you're using something like Comfy UI, which is an on-machine um, uh, orchestrator, it can, yeah, as you say, it can be free, and you can do workflows in Comfy UI to actually generate. But Nana Banana, 14 to 15 Australian cents per image, can get a little exy if you're doing quite a few. Need help with AI solutions? Click on the channel link and follow the link tree.